Christmas is behind us and we are in the very thick of wintertime fishing. I'm gonna share with you two tips to be able to fish the fluke during this time of year. Number two is the Demiki rig. What the Demiki rig offers you is the ability to take a little fluke style bait and present it up over top bass that are feeding primarily on shad, shad balls. So if you can picture it, this thing is just there, just quivering just like that. And then you have fish looking up at it just like this. There's some devil in the details of what you need to make this thing work. Number one is the line tie. You're gonna need a line tie that's at a 90 degree angle. Cause with this bait, you're not necessarily casting it out and reeling it in. What you're doing is getting right over top of the fish, almost like you're ice fishing, dropping this just above their snout and just holding it there. And you see how that thing right there is just quivering ever so slightly? All you're gonna do is just hold it there and let it do its thing. I like to go with a bait that has a little bit of color and these big eyes like that. And that's why I particularly like to go with VMC. Their neon moon eye jig head is fantastic. It gives you that 90 degree line tie that you need, but also it gives you these very big bulbous eyes that help reflect a lot of light. Now, what I want you to do is pair this up with a Zoom Junior, or here's a really kicker trick, gulp. I want you to go with the one inch and two inch version. If you're gonna go with the, the one inch version, you're gonna have to downsize your hook a little bit, but if you just go with the regular two inch gulp version, that's perfect for this type of setup. Why gulp? The max scent that gulp allows you to have, you're just doubling the odds that you're gonna be able to get one of those fish to commit. And this is amazing with smallmouth. Now, weight of the head. Go with a one fourth ounce head because you need it to be a little bit heavier to be able to get it down and hold it in this specific water column. Before I reveal my number one trick for fishing a fluke this winter, let me know in the comment sections below, what is your favorite way to actually fish a fluke in the wintertime? Do you fish a fluke? What is your number one bait to fish this time of year? Number one, one of my favorite techniques to use this time of year is a spy bait. It has that ability to just slowly creep its way through the water column with this nice little shimmy action. And that shimmy action is absolutely deadly. But the spy bait has its limitations, namely these hooks. A spy bait is just not very weedless. And that's where my technique comes in, which is using a spin head jig. By using a spin head with a fluke, we are able to have the weedlessness that this offering provides us However, we still get the benefit of the propeller action. You want to go with a one sixth ounce all the way up to one fourth, depending on where you're going to fish. You can use this anywhere. You can use this when you're pond fishing. You can use this when you're bank fishing. You can use this from a kayak, a boat. It's a cast and slowly reel back technique. Whereas the Demiki rig is very specific niche of you need to be over top them have them identified on a graph of some sort, and then hold it above them. If you like this information, if you did, comment below. Let me know your favorite baits to throw this time of year, and we'll see you next time.